freed up a lot more of my time last year and gave me the ability, like I said, to come out of tax season and say, oh, that was the best tax season ever. You know, actually through this program and through the coaching and stuff, it has actually changed my attitude. And I think from a mental standpoint, that attitude has drawn people toward me, new prospects and clients who uh, were not even prospects before, but all of a sudden start referring people. Well, if your thinking is simply for a product that you're getting out the door, you're going to be very tunnel visioned in that approach. You're going to be just saying, I need to get XYZ products done today. If you limit your thinking to that capacity, you just, you basically shut your mind to the opportunities that are presented each and every moment. So if you've shut your mind to those other opportunities, well, you're Basically, you're just closing the door for that uh, to happen. It doesn't really come naturally, and especially during tax season, it's so busy that you don't have a lot of time to plan and think. You're more in the doing mode. It's too easy to fall into the, the ruts. It's just too easy to get down in there. And, you know, to a certain extent, that's a comfort level for some CPAs. But the opportunities that continually come through the door you know, need to be, you know, you can't just shut your mind. You can. You can just shut your mind to any new opportunities. Holding holding on too much to the history, um, to how I used to feel and, and how it kind of holds me back. My own, my own self or my own person holds me back a lot. So I just as accountants and CPAs, uh, we tend to work as historians way too much of the time. And historians don't always get the vision. Uh, it always helps too if some, you can have somebody else help you get that strategy and plan in place because again, small, look, smaller firms tend to be very busy and don't have a lot of time for that. And quite frankly, we might you know, not be really good at it. I guess to sum it up, it would be, because I've had a lot of other professional development CPE in, in different areas over the years, and they're, it's all good. It's all bits and pieces. It's kind of pieces of the puzzle. And the uh, action vision, I would say, is more of the whole puzzle complete. Like, we're going to give you the whole puzzle, not just one piece. Okay, in, in the beginning, it gave me a lot more focus and a lot more understanding as to where I am and why I'm doing what I'm doing and who I should be doing it for. And uh, that in my uh, vision circle basically enlightened me a lot. My personality is very comfortable in, you know, where I'm at. And, oh, well, do I want to go there? It's like, well, yeah, I do. Or, you know, or am I satisfied to go back into the shadows and, and do my little thing that I felt like was making a difference in somebody's life?